This is uh, Daniel Garza from Costa Sur Fishing. I'm out here at a new uh, area in Port O'Connor. It is uh, really, really uh, cloudy. Didn't forecast any rain, but uh, anyways, I'm still gonna expect it. I hope that uh, I can bring you guys a decent video. Stay tuned. I'm out here with, uh, with my buddy Nick and, uh, and another friend, uh, David, trout chaser. And let's see if we can get, get on some fish. I'm really, really, really hoping for uh, me to get a bite this today because uh, it's, uh, it's been a while since I've had a limit. Anyways, stay tuned. There is a blow up right there. I'm gonna cast over there and see if maybe I can get something. Oops. Oh. I'm gonna keep my camera at a safe distance in case it does rain. There's some turning red right there. They didn't go for it. There's a lot of tailing reds out here. It was nice to see them. I didn't get anything, but it was really nice to see them. my first fish easy oh he went into the boat oh that's not good oh he's fighting nice let me get my net a nice little red red it's a nice little fight look at that dude he was just, oh man, I hope he's a keeper. First one on the black hoagies. Get over here, dude. He's gonna get tired up already. He's tired. Oh, don't go there. There you go. Nice. Nice little feller. Yeah. Oh, I saw him. I saw him eating on some some bait. Too bad he hit the wrong lure today. Look at that. Look at this little rat red. He's not gonna keep, but we're gonna measure him anyways. I'm gonna let him loose in a second. First fish of the day. Look at that tail, blue tail. Looking pretty good. Let you guys see this guy right here. See that? Let him loose. Take that out of there. Hurry up and measure him. You folks want to see what he, what he measures. And uh, in case you guys don't know, I know I got, he is supposed to be at 20 inches and this guy is going to be, oops, hold on a second. Let me, I got him backwards. All right, he is at 18 inches. It was 18 inches, so we went ahead and let him go. And he's gone. Well, folks, that uh, lure, the uh, hoagies, the black one was the first one I cast it out. There was uh, some blow ups, I cast into it and I was able to get a red. He wasn't a keeper, but uh, I didn't get skunk. So I'll take it. Anyways, let me keep on uh, casting this, uh, this black hoagies and see if we can get some more fish. I'm going over here to where this bird is at because uh, he's working, he's feeding. 
so this guy's my little snitch I'm gonna start here because I think this is probably a pretty good starting point and I'm gonna work my way that way along the shoreline here there's another pelican right there they just landed you can't see it is a little far but uh, I like that that pelican's been working this area look at that he's coming around again so that's a good indication right there yep okay well my bird left he's out there now I'm still heading where he was at I just have a good feeling about this using the midnight crawler well I see bait moving here so that bird was right I, I need to get closer I'm too far away from the shoreline I want to be a little bit closer he's running he's on run a little bit coming to me Little flounder, little flounder pounder. Look at that. Got me a little flounder. I'm working. Oh, this boy was splashing all over the place. Look at that. Okay, don't want to lose you. It's a nice little flounder. Perfect cook set. We're going to keep this guy. Put him in the water. Keep him. Ain't going nowhere. And then I'm gonna tie it, tie it to this clip here. Give him some slack. There you go. He's he's set right there. All I'm doing is uh, casting it bringing it working the bottom of the mud bumping it occasionally I'm using this black hoagies and the uh, swim hook it's a little risky because they had been coming off in the past uh, two fishing expos that I did Look, there's something there there was something there I took a bite out of it. Slow retrieve at the bottom. The water's a little bit murky. I've got this dark paddle tail red that I've been using. Put a little taco sauce on it. And, uh, Get you a flounder, easy money. Easy money, won't be long. I'm gonna catch something here in a minute. Hopefully it's a flounder. I love to eat flounder. I think flounder is the best, the best fish out here, better than, than trout. Trout's probably second best, but that's just my opinion. There it is. There it is. That was a bite. I got another one. Easy does. He's a smaller end though. Smaller. Let me get my net ready. Keep him in the water because if you try to take him out, he'll get loose. Oh no, he's a keeper. There it is. Uh, another keeper. All right, where's my my grips? This is another one. Oh, he's shaking. Just that shaking.
Open your mouth, dude. Little flounder pounder. He chunked this. Look at that. He, he swallowed the whole lure. What in the world? Man, what was he thinking? Okay, there you go. Uh, it's all the way in there. All the way in there. Okay. Well, folks, that is the second flounder of the day. And one red. Um, it's It's been pretty good fishing out here for Okana. I'm gonna keep on fishing, see if I can get some more fish. I've got two fish, which is dinner. Man, I'm having a, I'm having a really good time. Oh, there's another one. That was a bite. It's another flounder. Nope, oh, missed him. He's coming this way. Flounder number three. These guys are just chunking it today. They're just swallowing the whole thing whole. Look at that. It's still. Oh, 14. See a 14 and a half. Yep. Bear, we made it. 14 and a half. Yeah. I'm having so much fun right now. Wow, well, we needed this. Three keepers. Smallest flounder I got today was a 14 and a half. Yeah, I'm just having such a good time right now. Look at my lure. I was just saying that I was going to use this one until it can't go anymore. I think it's seen better days, but I'm going to use it one more time, see if I can catch a third one. I mean, a fourth one. Look at that. Once this leg falls off, I have to get a new one. And uh, the sad thing is that this is the last, the last uh, black hoagies that I have. So after this, I don't have any more. After three flounders and a red, the hoagies is done. We're gonna put this guy, we're gonna lay this guy to rest. Uh oh, I have another one. It's a little torn, but I'm gonna use it. Keep using it. Found one. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ah feels good I feel good da, 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 da. <laughs> oh yeah God almighty that was a nice little it's a nice little flounder look at this guy just got this guy man he hit it hard he chunked it forgot uh, that's it but uh, I do want to uh, want to um, throw a shout out to my friend Rena and to Sam Rayburn High School 2020 graduates. Congratulations. Well, that's it folks. Thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and click on that subscribe button. And I really, really hope you enjoyed this um, video. If you did, give me a thumbs up, give me a like. And don't forget to click on the notification bell. Um, it'll give you more of the videos that I upload. But uh, that's all she wrote. See you in the water. Wait for it. Peace out. <laughs>